to begin with, could you please introduce yourself? I'm Nick Ray. I am the hardware innovator here at Priva. Uh, Priva is uh, a family-owned organization uh, with 500 people. Our history with VE goes back uh, five years now. And I started with a hardware engineer and a embedded software engineer. How would you assess the technical ability of your virtual employees? Skill level is, the average is probably higher than here. I think their, their work ethic uh, and commitment is very high. It's higher than a typical engineer. Uh, here in Europe. Why did Priva decide to outsource uh, in the first place? Instead of hiring one engineer locally, I can hire two engineers in India. Oh, why don't I try that? That's how it started. I think if we'd have gone to HR here, the number of candidates that we would get would be very limited. Uh, and as I mentioned before, it takes a long time. VE offered me a choice of hardware engineers and a choice of software engineers immediately on the very first day uh, and I, I had the feeling that I had a luxu luxurious problem to deal with. The only way of starting quickly was to outsource and to go offshore. Nick, how would you summarize then the overall performance uh, of, your, of your virtual employees? In two words, excellent and pleasurable. I think uh, looking back over the five years, uh, not only did I not have any uh, communication problems, we didn't really have any project-related problems. I always felt that the people in India were sitting next to me. Nick, would you recommend virtualemployee.com services? Certainly. I think Virtual Party is a very good ambassador for India.